Next up, we have the Samsung series. This is our Samsung 35E and Samsung 50F. So you can see Samsung 35E, which is 3,500 milliamp hours. This is an 18650 cell. You can see the stamp there for certification, Samsung SDI. And then you have the 18650 35E. And then we also have the Samsung 50S. Um, we can kind of rotate this one a little bit. You can see it better. <clears throat> it's a 21700 50S and Samsung SDI. So um, this is the next testing we're gonna be doing for these two cells. I'll post the results. We're gonna be doing our power and range test. All right, so here's the test results for the Samsung series test. Um, we have the Samsung 50S and the Samsung 35E. So as you guys can see, I have those on three and four. So three is the green 21700, four is the Samsung 35E. We're gonna do the Samsung 50S cell first. So as you can kind of see here, we have like our data curves um, and we have red as our voltage. Uh, dark blue is the current draw. So you can see where we drew current. Um, you want to pay attention to this column for a positive and negative. You can kind of see here we have negative 10. So you can see it going below down to negative 10, showing that the power test is correct. We wanted to do 10 amps. And here you can see this one, uh, we did a discharge on this side. It's probably like negative one. Yeah, one amp uh, discharge drain. So you can see the negative one amp in this section as it's going down. So as your test results for the range, the Samsung 50S cell had 5.1. You can see right here, I'll click on uh, 5.1 see uh, 5.1 capacity so that's good the cells are rated at 5 amps so 5.1 is great uh, for the power test you can see here it went out to 4.8 so 4.8 is the discharge you can see here 4.8 there's a lot of data points and you can even see the negative 10 amps that we're pulling out so negative 10 amps and you can see the capacity was uh, 4.8 and as we close this one and we open up the Samsung 35E, the Samsung 35E, um, you can kind of see the data chart as well. Red being the voltage, you can see the voltage go up and go down, and go up and go down. Uh, you can see the current. Down here is the capacity. It's the capacity. It's a, the capacity was at its highest point in the first test, which is the range test, which is expected. The last one is the energy, the wattage overall. And for the results here, you can see the Samsung 35E had 3.59, so very good results there. Um, no complaining on the range test. 3.5965 was the, the data point that it had. We charged it up again and then did our last power test. This one, 3.22, not too bad. The uh, These only are rated for uh, 8 amps, so I actually kind of over pushed them. I won't probably won't be able to use that cell anymore since it took it past its limit So I'll uh, take that cell away. But yeah, here's the results uh, 3.22 for the for the power and 3.59 for the range. This is for the Samsung 35e